Well, we have crossed the halfway point of October. We're now into the later half, and we have been hunting very hard. We're set up right now, doing a hanging hunt on kind of a windy, rainy night, but we are out here, and we're all, all ready to hopefully have a shooter come through. But we, we've been out every chance that we've gotten, weather permitting. We've hunted as much as possible. It's October 2nd. It is October 3rd. It's October 5th. It's October 7th. It's October 9th. Well, it's October 10th. It's October 14th. It is October 16th. We have been seeing quite a few deer, and we've actually started to have some shooters get on camera and had them start to get on their feet. So between Dylan, me, Melanie, Giuseppe, the crew has been hunting hard and uh, we're hoping to harvest a deer soon. We actually have just over a week before we head down to Ohio and do an out-of-state hunt. So we're getting really excited for that, getting geared up and there's some good deer down there. So really excited for that. But before we get too far into the season, I wanna take you guys back to an awesome hunt that we had last year where Mike and I rattled in the first buck I've ever rattled in. And uh, Mike definitely made it count. So I'm not gonna say much more. We'll get right into that footage, guys, and I hope you enjoy it. All right, well, it is November 15th, and if you're a Michigander like me, you know it's opening day rifle season, and uh, Mike and I are sitting in the cabin and have had a really eventful morning. We've seen like 30 plus deer, a few bucks this morning, I had a small eight and then a small six out in this north field, and then we've seen a couple other smaller bucks and uh, a lot of does, but they're doing some chasing, and um, we just a little bit ago had a buck that he looked like a shooter. We didn't get a really good glimpse at him. He ran over this hill and Mike was trying to get out of a lane. He chased another buck off a small eight and then came back and just showed us kind of like his horns on this corner here at like 60 yards. And we could tell he has like really dark horns, but don't know how big he actually is. And then we were trying to get him to stop when he ran back over the hill and he never, never did stop. So if he is just over that hill, there's a swamp back there and he might be bedding or um, posting up with a doe. And so I'm thinking in a few minutes here, we're gonna rattle and see if that'll get him out. Cause he seemed really aggressive with that other buck. So I think we're gonna rattle and see if we can uh, call him over the hill. And if not, what do we have to lose? We might, might see some other bucks. So we're gonna rattle here in a second and uh, Hopefully have some action here, man. But November 15th, what a morning. A little bit of snow on the ground. It's beautiful. Always good to be out here.
You shoot him again. Yep, he's down. No way we just rattled him in. Dude, are you No way. We just <laughs> rattled him in. That was so sick, dude. <laughs> what did I say? Oh my god. I was like, if he's bedded right back here, we can probably. <laughs> He came charging in just like he left. Just like he left. Dude, that's insane. I went, did you just do center cross air? Yeah. And he had to be like probably 150. Yeah. 1140. That is nuts, dude. dude you ran all that. Yeah. <laughs> that is so sick. Dude, this buck. Came running by us two different lanes that Mike tried to shoot him at. He's like a chocolate horn. I don't know if he's an eight or a ten. Goes back in the swamp and I was like, maybe if we rattle, he'll come out. And sure enough, like maybe one minute after I rattled, you yeah. think? Maybe. He come charging back and we got a shot. <laughs> Mike freaking dusted him. That's alright, we can just send him a text of a picture. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I can see him laying down. Yeah, right I could see him. Yeah. We're gonna go see if we can recover Mike's buck. First deer I've ever rattled in for whether myself or somebody else to shoot, so that was awesome. But we're gonna go to the spot where we thought he was at when Mike shot and see what we pick up. Pine sticking up. Oh, he's got split brows, Mike. Oh my god, dude. Look at that deer. <laughs> he's got oh. split brows, dude. <laughs> you gotta oh, be kidding me, dude. <sighs> split brow, 10 pointer, actually 12. <laughs> you gotta be joking, man. Wow. And I've never had this one on the camera here. That is incredible. What a cool buck. Look at how dark he is. <laughs> dark forehead. Oh man. Brows like that. He's just dark all around. Yeah. Be a swamp. swamp buck, huh? Yeah. Oh, my wow. goodness, man. Wow, wow, wow. Three years in a row, huh? Yup. <laughs> <laughs> Get him in and tag him over there. 